Corona Light beer review, second time around. If I've reviewed it before, I think I gave it a, a good score. I think it was good. I uh, always think this is a good light beer, American style light beer. I like Corona, it tastes like Corona. So, But the price is always high. 12 pack, 12 bucks, 10 bucks, 6 pack, 6 bucks. Um, that's the only drawback of the beer. Um, smells like American Agent Lager. Cooked vegetable. Smell to it. It's not a bad smell. Looks like one. Light yellow. There's semi. There's some carbonation. Tastes like Corona. Little lighter version. Has that sourness, breadiness, malt. Highly drinkable, drinks like water. I don't think it's bad. A lot of people think it's bad, but Beer Advocate rates it poor. It's far beyond poor. If, if it's poor, it's because it of is that there's better beers with better prices. That's the only thing. Nothing wrong with it. I like Corona. Corona has, they say, a skunkiness, but I never, never tasted it. I always like the sourness, the, the bite to it. It's a good, it's a really, I give it a, um, I give it a B plus, 89. It's good to very good for a light beer. That's what I'm comparing to, apples with apples. Light beer with light beer. Against Bud Light, Bush Light, Romance Delight, Old Milwaukee's Best Light, uh, Milwaukee's, uh, what else is there? Coors Light, um, all of them, Sammy Adams like this is this holds its own against those. The price point is different. I'd rate it all right. The price point against Amstel Light, I would. If I like this. I would. If if this is in the cooler, and that's the only thing, I wouldn't be, wouldn't be disappointed. That's what for sure. The price is again the only thing that draws it back. If it was priced like Old Milwaukee or Milwaukee's Best Light, that would be a no brainer. But six ninety nine compared to two ninety nine. A six pack to Milwaukee's best light. That that tastes more. It tastes probably a little better than this, and it's half the price. Well, that's a no brainer. Pick that. If you're trying to press people, go with this. But nobody knows. The only thing with Milwaukee's best light is the the smell. But it's better than Bud Light. It's up there with Coors Light too. But with Coors Light, I I pick this because Coors Light's cheaper. They're willing to you know if it's in the cooler, I pick this. Um, great beer, great Mexican beer. Um, I don't, I don't have many, uh, many great Mexican beers because the price point's too much. I always think American beers are better priced, better tasting than the Mexican beers. This is a good Mexican beer. Um, the, cor the regular is good too. Corona Light and Tecate Light. I picked Tecate because of the, Tecate likes the price. Um, one, but I wouldn't turn my back on Corona Light. If I had it, I'd drink it. Corona Light, been drinking it for a while. Summer, I'll pick it out in the cooler any day, order it for a refreshing beer. Quick, cool, refreshing. It's better than having a, a, a triple stout out there trying to get cool and refresh. Probably, or some uh, some uh, pale ale, double pale ale by uh, Firestone you're trying to drink up. It's going to be too... It's, it's not refreshing. This is a refreshing beer. That's what's his main purpose of a light beer. It's crisp, clean, refreshing, and qu quenches your thirst. Um, if you had it, let me know. Comments, questions. Do you like Corona Light? Is it, is it worth the, the F rate, the poor rating on there? I think it's way better. I think it's, again, at least a B to an A minus. Good, pretty good to good. Cor Corona Light. Again, let me know. Comments, questions. Subscribe to my channel and thanks for watching. Bye.